right, so we got my Dodo Krug ready. Ready. We named him. Danny, Daisy, Dolly, Daphne, Danielle, and Dave. Oh, that was the wrong gun. All right, that was better. Hey there, folks. Maisie, I'm reporting for duty, and today we're going to do a couple of things. One of the things that we're doing is we're going to make a Carno saddle. Now, we're on the Ark Survival Evolved, Pooping Evolved Vanilla Center Map Server. That's where we're at. Man, uh, all that's always a mouthful. A mouthful. That's right, a mouthful, which is just a little bit, but a mouthful these days. So we're going to make the Carno saddle because uh, I want to I wanna go exploring on land. But there's also some other crap we have to do. We have to deal with. I realized recently that I am kind of behind. Um, like I'm, I'm trying to run before I can walk. Like I don't even have scuba gear, and like I need to be able to get oil and silica pearls and stuff. So I've been killing trilobites, but that's really, really not as effective. And you need water dinos. Like I need a, a bunch of water dinos. I need a ichthyosaurus very badly. I need scuba gear. And I can't make scuba gear. I'm not even level 75 yet. Plus, I haven't even made a fabricator. But you know what I'm going to do right now? You do know? Is it a thing that you know? Oh, man. Oh, oh crap. I'm going to make a fabricator. And so you probably noticed that my base looks a little bit different. And that's because I'm, I've open concepted my, my bottom floor. Now, I did want to show you guys something, too, that I think that the DLC... Um, version of the center has made it so that no clip structures aren't working uh, properly. Um, because I should be able to place these, but I can't. These are no clip, it's a no clip foundation. I was only able to place these two foundations, and I'm not placing back farther. So I'm just gonna put a fabricator there. And the reason why I did that was because I want to keep my storage up, and then this is on the opposite side of the storage, and on this side of the storage is the smithy and, and that stuff. So, I'm getting, uh, trying to get some convenience there. I really want to just get, like, my main part of my base up, uh, so I can do, do all this stuff. And I want to get that underwater bubble base up, because I think it's going to be really convenient for gathering underwater resources. Um, anyway. I wish we had Stargate. The Stargate mod on this vanilla, vanilla server that we have a couple of mods on. Let me see, what am I doing? I was getting my fabricator. Give me my fabricator, give me that. I also need some hide. Where's the hide? I've named all these things, including this one, which is just question marks. Uh, animal parts, yes. Hide, yes. You, take this hide and this oil. Make gasoline, please. And I forgot I had all these other animal parts on me. Take these animal parts, please. Oh, that's not an animal part. Bam, fabricator, bam, place fabricator. Oh, that's not a fabricator. That's a fabricator. There we go. Placing the fab now. It's gonna hang off the edge, I don't care. All right, so we've got a fabricator, which we can't make anything in. Scuba is coming right up, level 75. We need scuba gear. It's, or we can fly. I mean, we can get some of this stuff if we, like, fly to the snow biome. I can grab up um, some oil there. But it's just kind of a pain, man. It's just kind of all a pain. So I've gone out today, and I gathered a bunch of stuff. Made some pillars and whatnot. I made a saddle for Mazjong. Mazjong's got a saddle now. Cheddarface and Mazjong. And XP boost went out. We went out together. And we, we gather all that stuff, but Cheddarface can only carry a very, very small amount of weight. It is a super, super pain in the burt. I tell you, oh, 10 gasoline. Check that out. We've got gas now. And we can use the fabricator when we're ready. What would we fabricate now? I don't I don't really know that there's anything that we would fabricate. I've got, uh, got no reason to fabricate anything, really. Man, we are so far away from getting me and monkey farm we need to go out and get ourselves quetzals the thing that we need to do and neither of us can make the platform saddle to do so 
It is a super pain in the Burt. As everything today is a pain in the Burt. Bam! I've got Bane Faces and Saddle! Woo! So, I was kind of wondering... I mean, I've been around my island a little bit. But I was kind of wondering what, what we had for offerings around this area. Like, are there any caves or anything? So I thought maybe I would kind of go on a little bit of an adventure. No flyer adventure. We got challenged to do a no flyer adventure a little while ago. And we were like, nah, I don't want to do a no flyer adventure. But today we're going to do a no flyer adventure. So if you see that island there, that is the island that Slipgator is building on. And in terms of the map, it is actually fairly close looking. And on the map, it seems like it should be a little bit more spread out. Um, hey, look, a Pteranodon egg. You ready to, to fight a Pteranodon, bang face? We should grab all the eggs we can find. Eat a dodo, bye-bye. Wait, did I, I need meat. I'm hungry. Um, no, I am not hungry. So I, I don't know like if there's any caves along the edge of this thing here or what the deal is, but Ah, get out of my way, Parasaur. Haven't uh whoa. Copies. So I'm thinking about making a change and I want you guys to tell me what your opinion is in the comments below. Uh, I was thinking on the days that I stream, I would do two videos, one at noon and one at six. I always stream in the middle for three or four hours. And I thought that that would be something that would be uh, advantageous for everyone. What do you think? Tell me in the comments below. Is that a good idea? Is it a bad idea? Do you hate it? Do you love it? I will read them. So my island really isn't that big. And I think we're already around to the obelisk side. We've got this little bay here. But I don't see anything on this side of the cliff. There were no caves. It was really kind of kind of lackluster. I ate that Meganera. It was delicious. It was delicious. So yesterday, I took the day off for the first time since August 2015. And I say that, but I worked. I don't know if I can have a day that I don't work. But since August 2015, I haven't taken a day off any day. And I took the first day yesterday. I mean, Triface, if you want to check Instagram, we'll see what we did. We did a little, little bit of a easy hike. We uh, went grocery shopping. We did some domestics. But it was really nice to to not work. I, I haven't had a day of not working for, for so, so long. It was kind of nuts. All right, so nothing major um, about this island. My island is kind of lame. We know we can get some metal on the island. I'm gonna eat this. I'm gonna eat this stego for fun. We know we can get some metal on the island. Um, we know we have Dodickers and Anki spawns here. I got a level. Nice. You're gonna die. You're dead. Now you're gonna die. You're dead. So we don't have like a ton of resources or anything. Nothing spectacular on the island. Let's go for some uh, health. That's been a while. What do we got here? What level are you? Oh wait, wait. What? Where's my spy glass? Where's my, where's my spy? I don't have a spy glass yet. Whose idea was this? No, I have a spy glass. Where, why is it not here? That's weird, man. Weird. I can't check the level of that Bronto. Oh, but I, yeah, I'm not, I'm not taming a Bronto without kibble. That would be, that would be crazy. Crazy stuff. So we had someone building on this side, didn't we? And I don't know if I figured out who it was yet. Did they move? There's another Carno. I can't tell what level the Carno is. I don't think they moved. Man. Come here. Hey there, Carno guy. You're dead. Your friend, the Raptor, is also dead. Bam. 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 So, I was looking for oil today, and the ocean drop-off... What the crap? This person has two Spinos, whoever they are. The ocean drop-off is kind of ridiculous. Um, I can't go down there without scuba gear. There's no way. 
So I ended up having to kill trilobites to be able to make my fabricator and get some gas. That was the only thing that I could do. Where's this guy getting spinos, man? And what level are his spinos? And who is this? No idea who this is. But I'm jealous of his spinos. 153, radiation. And Ripjaw. Ripjaw's a good name. 157. And tribe of nothing in Teres. And we have no idea who this is. I don't know who... It, do you have, doors locked. I could see who... What his you know, body looks like. If I could get into his house. But I can't get into his house without making his dinos angry. But it looks like he's doing good, man. He's got two two cool spinos. I wish I had cool spinos. I'm very jealous. Very jealous. Hey, this one's amazing. Nom. Um, not amazing anymore. All right. So our island looks like it's pretty boring. And it looks like I'm weighted down far too much. Far too much. Drop all items. Yes. Here, have some meat. So I'm wondering if there is anything on the other cliff side of this island, but it looks like as far as resources go, you're not really getting much here. There isn't really a lot to have. Just my little bay where we're going to have, you know, water dinos and be able to hmm, be able to defend ourselves on PvP day once a month. Anything on the side? I think it would be really cool if, if this cliff had like an entrance and there was like something inside of it. I mean, it seems kind of like a waste. Have like such a nice large rock area and have nothing in it. And there, there's really no predators here. Like I don't have any... T-Rexes, there's no Spinos. We got like some Carnos and some Scorpions. But they're not very difficult to destroy. Especially since Baneface is so ballerific. Uh, I mean, Baneface is so low level. But <laughs> he does a good job. He does a good job. So yeah, like they have all kinds of cool stuff all over this island. But on my little, I mean, uh, all over this map. But on my little island. Oh, I killed a 110 Dino. Uh, there really is nothing just the bay like the it must be because it's a defensible you know position oh we made another dymo mad what is that say 140 oh it does say 140 that's that's terribly unfortunate that i had to kill that dimorphodon because it was going to destroy me there's metal down here what is there metal down here for the poor man that can't fly up to the top. They just left you a little a little something. Maybe there's an entrance on this side, and I just don't know it. Nom nom, Parasaur. You're destroyed. All right. So we're building up to do that. That uh, pen build. But unfortunately, I need 1,500 1500 metal ingots um, in order to make the behemoth gate that I need to make and I don't have the facilities yet including an industrial forge to be able to do that like I, can't, I don't even think I can make an industrial forge yet did I not kill die I don't even think I can make an industrial forge yet industrial nope requires level 85 we can make a grill though oh man Industrial grill. Check it out. Totally learning that. It looks amazing. And like it will make nonstop rocking possible. All right. Still no entrance to any sort of cave or anything awesome in here. What is that? Uh, just some more metal. So, yeah, that's the whole island. That's the whole place where I live. And besides some mantas, there really is nothing in the bay either. I'm actually really uh, not happy that the no-clip structures aren't working. And I'll show you why. 
come down in here, you can see Geronimo. Oh, you can maybe barely see. Oh, there's some rocks here in the water that I can't clear. There's no way to clear them. They look like brains. They got like brain type indentations. But I knew that I was going to have to use no clip pillars there in order to do the build that I want to do. So I'm kind of concerned now that that won't actually be a thing. So I don't know what to do. I'm, I'm almost thinking that this might just be a water pen and then I'll just build in that air bubble down there. I don't, I don't know, man. Definitely going to figure out a way to build something here. Too much meat again. Bam. So in about 15 minutes, we did a little, a little bit of a tour here. See what resources we had. See if there was any, any sort of, like, I'm really sad that there's no, like, cave in that cliff. Doesn't really make any sense. And I was able to build the fabricator, show you my my new open concept area, which is terrible. I really need to build um, build something better. Build something up. And I, when I tried to take Shay down to the bottom of the ocean, I actually wouldn't have made it there and back with uh, the amount of breath that I have. I would have to get more oxygen, but I don't want to spend any more points in oxygen. I actually am worried about crafting speed right now. I want to be able to build faster. Um, it's really an arduous task to go out and do a bunch of building. Kind of a pain. No, no. What are you? Get off of my fabricator. Why? Are you, no. Why are you standing on the fabricator for? You might break something. You jerk. Vein face. All right. You're good. Um, do I have any meat for you? I think I dropped all your meat. And then we had no pteranodon come try to kill us. I'm very sad about that. Got two eggs. Woo. Amazing. All right. So. You know, I thought I thought that our little adventure would be longer. I'm going to have to figure out what we're going to do with the rest of our day. I'll be right back. All right, I was thinking about it, and what I was going to do was I decided that maybe I'd go and tame myself an ichthyosaur because I really need one, and then it came to me, I need dodo kibble, and that would be really, really easy to get. All I got to do is go out here and find some dodos and shoot them in the face, right? And then we can get some dodo kibble. It's no big deal at all. So I've been killing, man. Uh, gamma's too. That gamma. Up. I've been I've been killing all the dodos I've been finding, and I'm like, man, you're a dodo for for doing that, Mazion, because I need to bring these dodos back. You know why am I not on my bird? All right, so I am now on my bird, and we're gonna grab up dodos. It's a female. It's perfect. We're gonna bring them back to the base. We're gonna shoot them in the face. We're gonna not name them Dave because we have to kill them if we name them Dave. And uh, we're just gonna we're gonna team them up right here. It'll be super super simple and easy, wicked fun. Bam! What's up, Dota number one? Boom! You're down. Pretty simple. You're down. Bam! And there was another Dodo right next to that Dodo. Where are you? I can't wait to have a Dodo army, with which to make eggs. With which to get... That's a male. We've got our one male. We don't need any more males. With which to uh, tame ichthyosaurs and Meth mesopithecus. Gonna get all kinds of stuff with the dodo. The dodo eggs. We need our seasoned monkey. Hey, what's up there, dodo guy? Um, Could I reload this gun, please? That would be amazing. Oh, thanks so much. Okay, cool. All right, so um, I don't think that you're going to need to eat that many. I'm going to take some of these from you, and I'm going to put them on you. There you go. All right, two dodos. Woo! All right, we're bringing back a 110 female dodo. Oh, man, all these, all three of these are already all tamed up. We've got three of these other dodos back here. Bam! Got a fourth one down. Wait, wait, you survived? It didn't take, it took more than one for it to go down. Which one of you has all of my medjo berries? Hey, thanks so much. Get this 110 up, please. Amazing. So I'm gonna keep getting these guys. I wanna have at least, you know, I don't know, two more females. And we're gonna name them all. All right, so we got my Dodo crew ready. Ready. We named them. Danny, Daisy, Dolly, Daphne, Danielle, and Dave. Oh, that was the wrong gun. All right, that's better. <laughs> All right.
So I, uh, I'm actually wondering, I think some time back they broke the insane. Oh, what? I didn't mean to pick up the dodo bird. I can't run when I've got a dodo. All right. Anyway, uh, I think they broke the insane ability to make dodos poop out eggs. And I'm not sure, but we're going to find out. Oh, man. I fed it so fast that it didn't poop. What if I do it this way then? That's better. But it used to be that you could just feed stemberries like crazy and the dodo would poop out all kinds of eggs. And right now the dodo's food is empty, so it's not pooping out anything. So let's try another one of these females. So funny. Do not feed, speed feed your female dodos. Will not work out well. What's up, Danielle? How you doing? You got enough food? You do have enough food. I'm gonna feed you some of these. All right, poop. That's poop. That's poop. That's poop. That's poop. That's poop. There's an egg. That's an egg. And now we're out of food. So I got one egg out of that. But they used to. They. I guess you can still do it. I guess they must have lessened the frequency at which they poop out eggs. So I need to make a trough. That's something I definitely need to do. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna end up doing that off cam right after this, I believe, because I don't have the metal to do it. Trough, bam. The trough requires, I thought, eight metal ingots, and I've got one. I don't need you on anymore, do I? We've got 70 gasoline. Amazing. None in here, and none in here. I don't have to collect myself some extra metals. Make a trough so I don't have to feed all these things by hand all the time. And, uh, yeah, that's going to be it for today, folks. I hope you enjoyed the, our time together today. If you did, make sure you blast the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to Maze Yon Plays Games for more Apple content. And, as always, be excellent to each other. Have a great day. See you later.